I you I imported here and uh, use it here in the object let's check our application that is it working as we expect I enter username valid username and valid password valid username is ionic at meet.com and valid password is one two three four five I and I uh, I click and uh, the button and as you can see I access the dashboard now I go back and uh, I entered invalid invalid email and uh, invalid password I entered dot net which is invalid and I enter some random some random password as you can see we got error 500 so as you can see if the email is something is from this array sorry if the username is from this array i entered this one in the first try and if the password is from this array i i entered this one in the first try that's why I I get this token sorry I also need to display it from uh, in the dashboard but I get uh, if I enter the valid credentials then then I get this I get this token and otherwise this error I also need to show you the... okay this is view now if I click on Wix in the base state we have token which is null this is our project and we have token which is null now I enter ionic Ionic at meet.com and one two three four five valid credentials as you can see now we have now in the state in the state we have token and uh, this getter is called and uh, this mutation is called with this data So this is the history. Now uh, I show my the to, the to, the the number which this API returning returns here in the dashboard. Okay. I I write I wrote some code in my dashboard component and uh, this is some this is simple ionic code but the notable the the noticeable t thing is this variable and this created is the life cycle method of view this method is called as the component is created and uh, when this component is created i call my getter method this this method get token this dot store dot getters and get token and i assign this the token returned by getter get getter method get underscore token method to this variable and i'm showing it here let's let's Ionic at meet.com one two three four five. 
and let me in. I also need to clear the history, but okay, don't need. I just click enter. I'm redirected to the dashboard, and uh, this is the token which is returned by this API. Our next step is to integrate Ionic with this, to integrate Capacitor with this project and build APK for Android. Okay, so I install Capacitor by using this command. I close this project. This is my project. Okay the Vexcape demo this is my project as you can see the dependencies are installed so now I run this command this command will ask me some questions like the app name I choose the default name app the app ID I choose the default example com dot example dot app and uh, I use npm okay now uh, I need to add the platform but before adding the platform I need some changes I click on capacitor dot config dot json and uh, my build directory is dist vue.js build the code to this directory and now i close the server and i build the project As you can see the build is completed now I go forward the next step is to add the, the platform and uh, the next step is the the platform is added so I also build the project the next step is to copy the the web code once you your once your web code is built it needs to be copied to each network project okay The next step is to open our project in Android Studio. I added Android platform, that's why I open it. It's it is I'm seeing this error. what it says okay one I should add the our Android